It's really, that's an interesting question because, of course, we are in the high-risk business, and high-risk means we need to have high return. And in our business, most things fail. So in order for the successes to make up for all the failures and then some, they got to be big, right? So often you hear 10x. It's like if you can't see 10 times your capital coming back, you probably shouldn't be making the investment. Um, now, it's also dollars in, dollars out. I mean, in a funny way, I mean, it's interesting because there's what you make, there's kind of what the LPs look for. So IRR is another one, right? Is it, if I don't make as much money but I turn it around very quickly, then that counts on my score sheet, right? So my LPs, if they see, like, like I think, and again, I don't know if the number's public or not, so somebody will probably shoot me afterwards or something. But, but you know, life to date, the Mobius Venture Capital Fund Series has, has, has had an IRR of like 90% pretty good. That's counting everything. That's counting even our bad stuff. So, um, so anyway, you look at the IRR and you say, well, IRR is awesome. But from my position as a GP, if, if I invest two million and a year from now I return four million, that's a hell of an IRR. But it was only four million dollars, you know? And, I, and the first two went to pay off the, you know, so, so the kind of the issue too is the more time you can play with the money and the bigger it grows, as a GP, at the end of the day, you get back a bunch of money. Your LP can take that money and invest it somewhere else. But once we return the money, it's gone. Right? We've got to go raise a new fund and start all over again. So there's an interesting dynamic there that it's sort of ultimately to a, to a VC, it's cash in, cash out. You almost never hear a VC say, guess what my IRR on the last deal was. Right? They'll either say, I got a something X, or they'll say, I made this much money for the fund.